It's all about the mouthpiece and the reed. The interior of the mouthpiece and the qualities of the reed will start the sound that we're hoping for. Uh, I'm not an equipment guy, uh, and I've never expected miracles from mouthpieces or saxophones. But I always hope that at least they'll cooperate and they'll allow me to say the sorts of things that I'm trying to say. I've actually only changed mouthpieces a few times in my life, and when I've done that, I've done it because the mouthpiece I was playing at the time decided not to go where I wanted to go. And so I have been involved in developing mouthpieces. Uh, and what I'm looking for in a mouthpiece is one that gives me as much latitude as possible in terms of tone, volume, immediacy of response. Uh, warmth is a, is a value that I take pretty seriously. And everything from a whisper to something a little bit on the bold side. And I kind of think I've found something that really works for me. And above all, I don't want my mouthpiece to have an agenda. I'm not interested in playing what someone else thinks sounds like a saxophone. I want something that responds to my efforts, to my voicing, and lets me serve the music as well as my imagination. I'm happy to share these mouthpieces with my saxophone colleagues, and I'm delighted to have you try and accept or reject, as the case may be.